channel so in today's video I'm going to be cleaning the mess that is um, that all my chicks have left behind um, Carrie is eating Popeye's chicken in the background so um, I apologize if she distracts you I can cover her up <laughs> okay. anyway so I am cleaning the porch that the chicks were in so they are all outside now this is actually the same day because I'm just going to get as much done as I possibly can in one day so that I don't have to work as much tomorrow. And so, this porch like is full of dust. It's just full of dust. There's so much dust and sawdust and everything. It's just so bad. So, I'm going to be taking care of that hopefully all today. I may or may not finish, I'm not sure yet because I haven't started, but that is the project for today. And if you haven't seen it already, make sure that you go and watch my chick video because um, it's basically the first part of this video. So without any further ado, let's get into this video. So right here is my very, very, very messy coop. Um, or it's not a coop, it's my porch. Okay, so the chicks are enjoying themselves outside right now, and they are actually loving it a lot more than I thought they would. But we've got to take care of this horrible mess in here. They have scratched sawdust out of their little playpen area thing, um, and there are cobwebs that just collected so much dust. It's like unreal. It's just horrible. Chickens make a lot of dust, so it is terrible to clean up. Especially like right here. Look at how much dust is right there. Like, oh my gosh. I have some um, tractor models and they are just covered in dust. Like it's so bad. Oh my goodness gracious. For sure, I'm gonna start by opening up all the windows so that I don't have to inhale as much dust. And here are my little chickies. They're all enjoying themselves outside. It is so nice out. It's like upper 70s probably. Um, so all the chickens are out and a lot of the neighbors are out enjoying themselves. And it's very, very nice out. So I've got all the windows opened up right here. So now I am going to get all of the chick mess out here. And then I've got to take some furniture out and yeah, it's, it's quite the process here. This might take me a couple days. And then for sure I'm taking care of my egg carton mess because um, yeah, that got a little out of hand.
everything out except the table because it's too big to fit through the door without disassembling, so I'm not bringing it up. But um, I've got everything out and it's very nasty, especially this table. Like you can see where I had everything. Like that's just so dirty, dusty. Here is my patio. Um, I by far have the best patio furniture out of everyone. I can guarantee you. Um, and the little chicks were watching me do the or do all the work here, getting all the stuff, as well as some elderly neighbors that were just sitting on their patio watching me. Like, I mean, I don't really care, but it's just kind of strange. They seem to, they watch me in the mornings too. They'll sometimes just be out with their grandson and they're like, oh look, chicken lady, I'm gonna watch them. Um, I mean, when you're old, you might get entertained easily, but I, <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, so this is all the stuff I have. Now it's time to start sweeping. So I think I'm going to open the rest of the windows here and then I will dust off all the windows. because you can't move this with air, but, <laughs> that was so but anyway, the table is definitely going to need a little bit more work. I didn't really work too hard on that because I also have that uh, that got stuck to it. I, I don't know how. Um, there was never a chicken up there. Um, but so I'm going to do that and it needs to be washed with like soap and water or something like that because um, we also sometimes eat off of this. So um, I, it, it still looks dirty because I am not done with it. I am definitely pleased about the wood. It's a lot cleaner. It looks so good. And the breeze in here right now, it feels so good. This is gonna get rid of like so much dust. Like I just put my hair down so that like, you can kind of see like, I don't know, the wind just kind of died down at the moment. Look at that, it's so windy. Um, yeah, it is like a very, very windy day. summer. I hope this weather stays. If it does not stay, I will not be happy. I mean, I don't mind the cold, just I wanted there to be cold when it was actually winter and there wasn't cold while it was winter. And then as soon as spring hits, it's cold. So I like this weather a lot. Now it is time to deal with all of this mess right here. Some of the chicken stuff is going to be in the garage or the coop or something like that. And then the stuff that belongs in the porch is going back in the porch. I mean, I especially have to clean that, like that's nasty. Um, so I'm gonna grab a cloth, start cleaning it. Well, you know what, first, I think I'm gonna deal with the table first here because I'm gonna stack all the stuff up on the table. So I'm gonna start with the table, then move on to outside. All right, so here's the table. I will deal with that later, um, but I'm going to move it back to where it belongs and then I will then work on that mess outside, the beautiful, beautiful mess. <sighs> So first 
things first for this. I'm going to start with my egg cartons here. Um, I might have to go on an egg carton hunt because a couple of them blew away. I did chase after them and got them, but they might have blown away again. Um, so, um, yeah, it looks like one of them fell on. Oops. Well, anyway, I'm going to... Oh, wait, no, I put them over there. Okay, never mind. So, I am going to take care of all the egg curtains and put them back in here. snap on the ground was just like oh my gosh what was that and I looked down oh an egg nice all right so anyway I'm gonna clean up that box and the egg and the bag and whatever and then we've got still got more stuff yay so now I am just starting to clean up some of the furniture that's outside with a damp cloth and I'm gonna shake out all the or dust all the pillows out and clean out all the chairs and put them back all into the porch. This is like so good. I love it when it's clean. Are you kidding me? <laughs> no. This looks ridiculously good. <laughs> Thanks. Wow. I can't wait till mom comes in here too. She's gonna love it. I'm gonna have a party. So as you guys just saw, my dad is very impressed with my with the fact that I'm cleaning this. So he had a pretty spectacular reaction. So I'm very hopeful that my mom will have an even greater one, even though my dad likes to mess around sometimes. It'd be funny, but yeah, this is why this is why you clean. So if you want to impress your parents, clean your room. Um, I'm also not responsible for the reactions though, because if they wanted it dirty and then you cleaned it, I don't know if they'd like it so much about it. So my dad just came back again and he looked in the porch and he's just like, this right here deserves ice cream. And right there, that is the reaction that you want from your parent. So I love making my parents happy and I love working and I love cleaning things. Like, I don't know. I know that a lot of people my age just the only thing they want to do is be on their like video games or stuff like that but like the five top things I like to do are ride horses play with chickens work run and that was four um, I mean I like relaxing on my iPad sometimes but you know the top four I'm gonna say don't even involve anything that a lot of people would want to do like working running I mean a lot of people run but like I love to run like even when I'm so incredibly tired I'll just go out and run it's just so fun um, and then I love to be outside with my chickens I love to ride horses and I love working like I don't know it depends on what kind of work if it's for my chickens and horses and whatnot I love to do it if it's for my room I'm like eh, I can't wait my fish come last. Um, I don't have. I don't. I have fish, but they. You know, they come last. Cause
because I don't really bond with fish, as I'm sure you understand. So they come last, but I mean, I still care for them just as much. There's some stuff that went off across the yard, so I have to um, go and get that. Um, but it was crazy because I came out here to get my little green tractor sitting right there, and it literally took a drive across the patio without me even touching it. That was, that was kind of funny. <laughs> Like that. So now I am gonna take care of all this stuff out here. I'm gonna start with the heat lamp here. No, this one here does not work. This one is the one I'm gonna take up to the chicks here in just a minute. Alright, so I've got my heat lamp here. We're gonna go out to the babies. They are enjoying themselves out here. Aren't you? So um, this is their first day out here, so I haven't really gotten everything ready yet. So I'm gonna put their heat lamp in here. Oh, see, the wind has blown itself a path into their sawdust. Oh, shucks. I did not realize that it was not recording. Here is the heat lamp. So, like I was saying, I don't know. Wow. Okay. See, it's windy. Um, but anyway, so. I am, I have hung their heat lamp up here. I don't know how warm or cold it's going to be tonight. So I'm just going to have it on here and if they need it, they can use it. So it'll also help them feel more at home because this is what they're used to. They're not used to not having heat lamp. Nori has a feather. I love it when the chicken, when the chicks play tag with feathers or something like that. You love to be out here. Except for what the wind blew off my table. It looks so good. Oh man. Oh, it's gonna be so nice to not smell chickens. So guys, here it is. The completely clean porch. 
it looks amazing. I can't believe that I did this all in one day. So, all in one day I have moved my little babies outside. I cleaned that whole entire coop that the chicks are in. I got, well I didn't get the silkies ready. I mean I kind of did, but silkies are going to be moving into the little coop. You can barely see it back there. Um, and I cleaned out all of this. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed watching completely deep clean my whole entire porch from nasty to beautiful. It looks so good now. I, It's going to feel so nice walking through here in the morning on my way up to the chickens. And my mom is going to be so impressed and my dad already has or already is. So that's a pretty good feeling here. So overall, this took, I don't know what time is it? 3.15 and I started at 1 o'clock so that was quite a bit of time but it was totally worth it it is so clean I don't know if it's just me but I love the feeling of clean like when something is so filthy and then I clean it and it's so clean it's just like oh I can relax now so that's what I'm gonna be doing after this so don't forget to leave this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. I am very hopeful that I can one day get a thousand subscribers and then after I do, I will be releasing a Feathers Forever t-shirt. So make sure that you subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Bye.